Hello buddy Eric here from Teach Nation and welcome back to another Black Ops 2 video. The gameplay that you can see on the screen is some uh, gameplay with the LSAT machine gun on hijacked and I believe this is domination, yeah it is. And look at that triple kill right there. But yeah, so what I want to talk about today is actually this gun that I'm using currently on the screen. So I just thought that I would make this little like in-depth video about all my favorite guns for each and every category. You know, submachine guns, assault rifles, light machine guns and everything. So yeah, um, I just thought that I would start off with the gun that I'm cur currently enjoying the most right now, which is actually this gun. So yeah, so as I already said, I will be covering the LSAT light machine gun and things that I will talk about is stuff like what attachments I would recommend and what perks and also what kill streaks. So let's go. So starting off, I'm just gonna talk a little bit about the attachments that I would recommend using. I believe in this video that I'm running with Red Dot Sight and FMJ. Um, because it's an LMG, you know, recoil is usually a, pre a pretty big problem, but I feel like for this gun it doesn't really have too much recoil that it, you know, can be annoying. So um, grip, I wouldn't really recommend using that for this gun. You can rather put, you know, FMJ on it to get more damage, which is always good, you know, so yeah. Okay, so now continuing with the perks, as you can see, I put up three perks on the screen that I would recommend using, and they are Blind Eye, Toughness, and Dexterity. Now, I believe in this gameplay that I, that I was using Ghost instead of Blind Eye, but to be honest, I didn't find it that effective. I don't know why, so, you know, definitely use Blind Eye instead because, you know, the enemy usually have some sort of air support up and that can be really annoying when you're trying to, you know, defend a flag, which is mostly what you will be doing with this setup. I mean, it is an LMG, so I don't think that you will be, you know, rushing around and, you know, being in their spawn that much. So, yeah, definitely use Blind Eye for your first perk. And moving on with the second perk, I would really much recommend using Toughness because, as I said before, this is an LMG and it will have a fair amount of recoil, but not too much. So, you know, Toughness really helps to, you know, stick on your enemy and, you know, hopefully get the kill so yeah and then for the third and last perk i would really recommend using dexterity because you know after you have been sprinting this actually allows you to aim faster which is really helpful when using a light machine gun because sometimes you know aiming down can be kind of slow but you know dexterity helps out a lot so yeah definitely use a dexterity when using light machine guns okay so now moving on with the kill streak setup that i like to use for this class as you can see i was using uav the guardian and the lightning strike now this is a really good setup you know for this map because as you can see i, I can just place out the guardian right there in the doorway and you know i'll pretty much get you know notified when there's an enemy trying to get in here and kill me which is really good and uh, yeah, I mean, this is more of a little, you know, personal preference, and, you know, it kind of depends on what map you're playing, but, um, as I said, I was using UAV, Guardian, and the Lightning Strike, and the Lightning Strike has to be one of my favorite kill streaks for this game, actually, because, um, it seems to me that you will almost always get a kill with it, and I don't know how many freaking, you know, quads and triples I have gotten with that thing, and, yeah, it is just an awesome kill streak, and then, of course, you know, UAV, which is something that I think everybody should use because um, as you all know people are still not level 55 so they will not have unlocked ghost yet so you know that is always really good to run and yeah it will kind of help you know where all the enemies are a little bit better but I think that's it for this video so be sure to leave a like if you want me to do more of these episodes where I talk about every gun in every category that I would recommend using and you know also don't forget to leave a like if any of these tips has helped you out and you know be sure to go out there and try this class setup but this has been Eric and thank you all for watching and I will see you guys later goodbye guys